think we should go off on black businesses because you had one bad experience. You know, I see if the people are just real nasty and mean to you, but if they try to fix the problem, you know, try to understand because a lot of times we go to Walmart and we don't get the best service. We go to Target somewhere, we go to McDonald's, some of these big corporations, and we'll get one bad experience there and we'll still go back to them, we'll still go back to Walmart. So, I mean, everybody's not perfect. And so sometimes you may have something that may not go your way and just because it's a black business, the reason I'm talking about this is because I noticed that a lot of people bash the black businesses when something don't go their way. Say, oh man, that's why I don't mess with black businesses. I never support them again. Now if it was something where a business was just being low down and just outright did you wrong, I can understand that. But a mistake, something didn't go right, that happens. It happens at Walmart all the time. You buy a microwave and it don't work. You uh, you be in Walmart and it's, they have 20 lines, 20 lanes, but only one cashier is working. And so you'll see 10 people walking around in the store and then say, hey, can, do you, can you tell me what the, all the milk is on? And you catch an attitude and people catch an attitude. And so, but we still go back to Walmart. So don't be so quick to talk about the black businesses because a lot of times we don't have the resources that the other business, businesses do. And, uh, but it's up to the black business to also be professional when they make a mistake, apologize, and try to fix the situation. So, uh, this is the Independent Ground. I'm a Dramatic Gamble, and I'm going to holler at y'all next time. Peace right. out. I want to get the language so right that everybody here will cry out. Yes, I'm black. I'm proud of it. I'm black and beautiful.